so what is up it's me again so today I'm gonna show you how to make a highlights and glow on the face or on some portrait like this one <clears throat> so for example let's say that you have this picture and it's look looking kind of boring this picture is actually pretty nice it has this this uh, light here and everything but I want to make it a little bit more better so before doing anything make sure the uh, the foreground color is black and background color is white you can uh, if if it's not just press d on your keyboard and x to switch between black and white now before again doing anything go to the go to the image mode and make sure the mode is 8 bits channel on these other channels the filters are not going to work some of them will not work now I'm just gonna make a <coughs> duplicate of this layer, press Ctrl G on your keyboard, then go to the filters and hit convert to smart filters. So this will make picture a smart object. Now go to the filter again, filter filter gallery, and I'm just gonna hit minus here a couple times. Go to the distort and diffuse glow. Now graininess for this image, I'm just gonna put it on zero. And with glow amount, you can mess with this, you know. So if you don't want too much glow or something, so I'm gonna leave it. You put it around five, up to six or seven, something like that. Four, three. It depends from image to image. It's not always same. And clear amount, I'm just gonna see this. I don't know. Let me see. I'm not. I'm not just gonna put it too low. So let's say. Something like this, maybe. Okay, that's good. And I'm just gonna press OK. Now, if this is too much glow for you, go in this icon here, double click it, and change mode to luminosity. And this will reduce the, the glow effect. Now, if you still don't like it and you want it to change, uh, to, to only make this filter on on the face so let's let's say that we want to want to do that go here on this white box where the smart filter is and press ctrl i <coughs> now here needs to be white and black and you can paint this so let's take the brush and just paint it over the face now you can reduce the opacity again if you want and yeah so this is pretty nice you can apply it on the hand for example if you want here like this or maybe on this couch so yeah that's it for this tutorial so before finishing this tutorial i'm just gonna show you before and after okay a bit more so this is before and this is the after so the picture is zoom in so i'm just gonna like this so the picture looks a little a little bit more interesting so you can lower the opacity if you want of course so put it like this so it, it, it doesn't have those harsh that harsh glow or you can just again go on this icon and uh, lower up the opacity don't do it here so this and lower the opacity maybe you know it doesn't it doesn't really matter you can mess with that it all it's all it depends from picture to picture so yeah that's it for that for this tutorial and goodbye